This is solvent weld waste pipe and this particular piece is 32mm. Uh, for domestic properties it's normally either 32mm or 40mm and this is a socket. If you make a joint using a socket on solvent weld pipe like this you can guarantee it's going to last a long time and it's highly unlikely that it will leak. Once you put the solvent on there it actually melts the pipe so the pipe and the socket actually melt to each other which is a kind of welding and that's why they call it solvent weld because the solvent actually melts the plastic. So I'm going to show you how to make a, a joint using solvent weld. So the first thing we need to do is cut the joint squarely. So to do that we're going to use this mighty box and we're just going to use this old saw to cut it. You can use any saw virtually to cut pipe like this because it, it will cut with any saw. So I'm just going to put the pipe in the mitre block and then we're just going to hold it in position and then we're just going to saw through it so that we get a straight cut. So there you go, we've got a nice clean cut but now we just need to remove all the burrs from the edges of the pipes. So we'll just remove the burrs using a file. So we've cut the pipe squarely, we've deburred it and we've also given it a wipe. But you need to check the instructions now that came with your solvent weld glue because some pipe and some fittings do need cleaning with a solvent before you use them. If you don't clean them with the solvent there's a good chance that the joint will fail over time. So it's vitally important that you read your instructions. So we're just going to give the fitting a wipe as well just to remove any debris. Now the important bit, we're just going to put a pair of safety glasses on. The last thing you want to do is get this in your eye. So when we undo the solvent, there should be a brush already in there. So now all we need to do is take the solvent and just apply it around the edge of the pipe. Then if you just take your fitting and just push it in there with a twisting motion and push it all the way in. You can then wipe any excess solvent off and if you just leave that for five minutes it'll be almost impossible to remove it because the solvent will have melted the two components together. So I'll just do the same on the other side. Again we'll just brush the solvent all the way around the pipe. Then we're just going to push that into the socket using a twisting motion. And then we'll just wipe off any excess. And if we leave that now for five minutes and come back to it, there's no chance at all of us ever pulling that apart. And once the solvent has evaporated, you can guarantee that that joint will never leak. It's uh, highly unlikely that a, a joint that's been made with solvent weld and been prepared correctly will ever leak. <laughs> 